in the lower 60s. The weather did not play a factor. Now to the latest on the recovery from Superstorm Sandy. There are neighborhoods that will never, ever be the same again, including Ortley Beach on the Jersey Shore. NBC's Stephanie Goss takes a look. You have to wear this when you're on the island. 16 school buses pick up and drop off. No one is allowed to drive. Two people per household carrying one empty bag each. Uh. Captain Bruce Burgess says this system is the only safe way to let residents back. We're here to help them. We're also here for security. Homeowners have only a few hours to collect valuables. They won't be allowed back here for weeks. I still didn't believe it until... I walked around the side and saw that the house had split open. And split open. Ortley Beach is in lockdown. Police officers from all over the country, as far away as Louisiana, work around the clock shifts. Over the next five days, 5,000 people will return. A boat in the living room among many nasty surprises. Engineers are busy putting numbers on the damage, and the most startling number so far is 73. That's 73 homes, not just damaged, but completely off their foundations and destroyed in Ortley Beach alone. Those homes still standing run the risk of collapsing into sinkholes. Keeping an eye on all of this is now suddenly part of Captain Burgess's job description. It all goes beyond the scope of what we're used to doing. This has never happened here before. Adapting to new jobs and changed lives, Ortley Beach inches towards recovery. Stephanie Gosk, NBC News, Ortley Beach, New Jersey.